Today at our TLN studios, we have the pleasure of a very special visit from Toronto City Opera, Mark Wilson, President, Sandra Tang, Treasurer. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for having us. Mark, I understand that Toronto City Opera is giving us a great gift, the opera of all operas, Mozart's Don Giovanni. Well, Mozart's Don Giovanni, a famous French author, once said that the three most beautiful things God has created are the sea, Hamlet, and Mozart's Don Giovanni. It's a classic tale of love, revenge, spiritual, supernatural. It's an engaging contemporary opera. I can only imagine how beautiful it would be sung in the original language. Absolutely. We sing it in the original language in Italian with English supertitles so that uh, people can understand what's happening in the action because the action is incredibly important in, in Don Giovanni, how the characters play with each other. Sandra, can you tell us something about the cast? We have the most wonderful cast uh, for this uh, Don Giovanni show and it takes about eight wonderful soloists uh, to be able to produce this most amazing composition of Mozart. Um, for example, uh, Michael Robert Broder is the leading role of John, uh, Don Giovanni and we also have some amazing soprano and mezzo-soprano, they're all award-winning um, singers, uh, local and also from the United States. Uh, what's the, the vision for this production? Well, it's a very interesting vision. I mean, uh, Don Giovanni is based on Don Juan, the great lover, the great seducer of women. Um, and what we have uh, decided to do is to make the opera relevant to contemporary audiences. We don't want to set it in an old-fashioned, you know, le uh, velvet breeches and lace cloths. We're going to set it in the 1940s in Hollywood and show it in film noir style. And we think that's a way to really bring forward this interaction, the sexual politics, the seduction, the supernatural, all of those elements can be made meaningful to our audiences today um, by, by putting it in a context that, that makes sense. So there's many ways to, to engage the audience in, what, in a meaningful way, not in, not in the old story. We can't wait for this incredible production. This is a question for both of you. Uh, sometimes we have this idea, you know, opera, music, you have to be well-dressed, you have to have money to go to a big theater, but opera is for everybody. Well, that's, that's our motto. Our, our, our motto is that we're passionate about opera for everyone. So this production is set in the Al Green Theater, very accessible at Blur and Spadine on the subway, parking nearby. And what's wonderful is it's, it's an intimate theater, 250 seat theater, very comfortable. You can dress up casually, there's, there's nothing formal about it, and the prices are very affordable. And I, I guess I can share with our viewers that Toronto City uh, Opera is the oldest continuing uh, company uh, uh, of its kind. What's, what's behind this success? Well, it's, it's interesting. It was originally uh, in 1946, there was a vision of bringing uh, opera into Toronto um, and, and a company was formed, um, and which over the years has evolved multiple times. Uh, the most recent evolution um, was as Toronto Opera Repertoire under Giuseppe Macina, which is when uh, Sandra, Sandra joined. Um, and then a few years ago, we re reinvented ourselves again as Toronto City Opera. Um, so we've continued to stay relevant to the opera scene in Toronto. We provide young singers a place to learn new roles, in fact, to, to build their resumes. We have a community chorus so people can sing passionately and be part of an opera production that they've always dreamed about. And as we said earlier, we make this affordable access for the community at large. I want to invite you to come to our amazing production of Don Giovanni at the Al Green Theatre at the corner of Bloor and Spadina. We have an evening performance on February 23rd and two matinees on Saturday and Sunday, 25th and 26th. Come join us. Come to the opera. Sandra, Mark, thank you so much for your time and thank you all for being with us. Thank you, Antonio. Our pleasure and thank you to TLN for all your support.